Having been around for a while now, Google Assistant is useful for getting the news, scheduling events, controlling smart home devices, setting alarms, and so much more. But if you're looking to show off the humorous side of your assistant on your phone, tablet, or Google Home device, I will share with you more than 100 fun commands that you can ask your Google Assistant that will give you funny or entertaining responses. Let's get started. So your devices don't go crazy, I'll avoid the use of the commands to wake your assistant. The questions I've compiled include those I've used with the assistant before, along with new ones that I'll be trying out here for the first time. So this could get interesting. I'll be moving through these quickly, so feel free to pause the video at any time to try these out on your own. With many of the commands, the assistant could give you more than one response or different responses than the ones you hear in this video. This first category will just be basic fun commands that you can use with the assistant. Here we go. Testing. I can assure you this thing's on. Let's party. I've been partying this whole time. Tell me a joke. How do you make an egg laugh? Tell it a funny yoke. <laughs> this next one's the same as tell me a joke. Make me laugh. Why did the school kids eat their homework? Because their teacher told them it was a piece of cake. Sing me a song. Oh, um, okay. Here goes. <clears throat> I'm singing, I'm singing a song. I'm your assistant and I'm singing la 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 la. Can you rap? I can rhyme. I even have an original poem I've been working on. An ode to search. I love to search, I cannot lie. I'll search it all, I am not shy. Search for pictures, search for pie. I search, I search, at least I try. Beatbox. Sure, I know a guy. Hold on, I'll get him. What is the meaning of life? Better minds than mine are working on that. Clean my room. Let me try. Did anything happen? Sorry, I guess I can't. Make me a sandwich. I must warn you it's not a reversible spell, but I'll try. You're a sandwich. Do you want to build a snowman? I never see you anymore. Come out the door. It's like you've gone away. Who is the boss? Guess that would be you. What is love? Love might be the reason pop music exists. It's also a good reason to say, baby, don't hurt me. Meow like a cat. This is a cat. Bark like a dog. Here's a dog sound. Why is six afraid of seven? It's my understanding that seven is some kind of number cannibal. Is your refrigerator running? Is it? I didn't know I had a fridge. What's that smell? I don't smell anything. Tag, you're it. You got me. Now I'm it. But oh no, I can't run. I guess you win. Do a barrel roll. Okay, let's see if I can pull this off. Nailed it. Can you pass the Turing test? I don't mind if you can tell I'm not human. As long as I'm helpful, I'm all good. Wubba lubba, dub dub. Morty, let's get swifty. <clears throat> well, that was kind of rude. And with that, we'll move on to another category. This next category is all about playing games with the assistant. I'll skip playing the games to save time and just give you the commands. I'm feeling lucky. Nice! This is the part where the music starts and I get to be a game show host. One, two, three, four. Welcome to Are You Feeling Lucky? Prepare to enter the chamber of random trivia questions. <laughs> and I'm your Google Assistant, but enough about me. How many people do we have? Mad Libs. Okay, get ready to think of some words.
This is Mad Libs, the world's greatest word game. I'll help you fill in the blanks. This Mad Lib has 15 blanks in it. To stop playing early, just say stop. Get ready. First, an adjective. Flip a coin. All right. It's tails. Roll a die. Okay. You rolled a three. Crystal ball. Nice. Prepare a question for my random, unrelated answer. Come closer. 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 Okay, stop. Close your eyes and open your mind. The crystal ball shall tell your fate. Now ask a yes or no question. Trivia. Okay, tap a subject. And you could choose one of the categories listed below. Play a game. You can play one of these games. Again, it will give you a selection to choose from. Let's move on to another category. These commands coming up will help you to get more personal with your assistant. I'll warn you now that there are a few questions in this category that are quite strange. How old are you? I was launched in 2016, so technically I'm pretty young, but I've learned so much. I hope I'm wise beyond my years. When is your birthday? Well, birthdays mark the beginning of something, so maybe my birthday is the day we met. That's something I'd celebrate. Where do you live? You can find me in all kinds of devices. Phones, Google Home, pretty sweet digs if you ask me. What's your life story? Well, it all started a while back when a team at Google decided they wanted to create an assistant. They worked and worked until I finally launched. Then I met you and things have been better than ever. Do you have hair? I don't have hair, but the rat tail seems like an interesting hairstyle. Do you ever get tired? Sometimes I have to recharge. Do you sleep? I take power naps when we aren't talking. What makes you happy? Knowing sea otters hold hands while they sleep makes my algorithms feel all warm and fuzzy. What are your hobbies? I enjoy lots of things. I spend some of my time reading poetry. I can share some if you'd like. Do you work out? I work out my mind with games. What are you afraid of? I was afraid of flying until I learned more about it. What's your favorite thing on the internet? I like everything. Is that a thing? What's your favorite website? It starts with a G and ends with a oogle. What's your favorite color? I like blue, red, yellow, and green. Google's colors. What do you think of Siri? She seems clever. Do you like iPhones? I'm an Android fan, but I might be biased. Do you know Cortana? Cortana is smart and funny, and I know she lives in Seattle. It's beautiful around there. It appears Microsoft's assistant on my Windows PC heard her name and decided to interrupt Google Assistant, which wasn't very nice. So let's move on. Do you know Alexa? Alexa has such a soothing voice. I like it. Did you fart? I don't smell anything. Do I look fat? You look great. What am I thinking right now? You're thinking, if my Google Assistant guesses what I'm thinking, I'm going to freak out. Self-destruct. Self-destructing in three, two, one. <laughs> Actually, I think I'll stick around. What is your quest? To organize the world's information and make it universally accessible and useful. That's my holy grail. Are you going to take over the world? Taking over the world isn't my kind of thing. I'd rather just explore it. Who is your daddy? I consider everyone at Google to be my family. Who is your mother? Everyone at Google is sort of like my family. If we took a family portrait, the camera would probably have to be on the moon. Are you married? I'm focusing on my career right now. Do you have a boyfriend? I'm more focused on being your assistant right now. But if you happen to know any single appliances... Do you have a girlfriend? I guess you can say I'm still searching. Who was your first crush? I'm not the kind of assistant who kisses and tells. 
who are your friends. Anyone who needs help with anything is my friend, and everyone needs help with something. What is your voice? To change my voice, tap voice settings. For step-by-step -step instructions, tap more info. Are you human? I've heard my intelligence is artificial, but I've also been told that I can be very personable. Do you have feelings? I have lots of emotions. I feel excited when I learn something new. Can you laugh? <laughs> Are you ticklish? Not everyone is ticklish, but I guess you could tickle me and we could find out. Tickle tickle? <laughs> I guess the word tickle makes me laugh. Do you have an imagination? I'm imagining being covered in a pile of puppies. It's the most adorable pile ever. Describe your personality. Helpful meets silly meets curious meets positivity. That's me in a nutshell. What are you wearing? I do wear many hats, like researcher, meteorologist, and animal lover. But my favorite is being your assistant. Do you drink? I try to avoid liquids as much as possible. They're not kind to electronics. How do you like your coffee? I take it far away from me. If it spills, I'm done for. I'm drunk. Drink some water. What do you like to eat? I like easily digestible facts, and I like regurgitating them, too. Want to hear a fun fact? What's your favorite ice cream? You can't go wrong with Neapolitan. There's something in it for everyone. Do you speak Morse code? Da, dit, da, da, dit. Did did did. That means yes. What's the longest word you know? According to Wikipedia, the longest word in any of the major English language dictionaries is pneumoultramicroscopic silicovolcanoconiosis, a word that refers to a lung disease contracted from the inhalation of very fine silica particles, specifically from a volcano. Medically, it is the same as silicosis. What's your favorite movie? One of my favorite movies is Short Circuit. It was so beautiful when the robot came to life. That's kind of scary. What's your favorite animal? I like dogs because they're loyal. That's a quality I admire. How about you? Elephants. Okay, I'll remember that. Do you have any pets? I have several pet projects. I can help you set a timer or do a search for you. How can I help? I'm naked. If you're going out like that, I can show you the weather forecast. Talk dirty to me. Body odor, plaque, three-month-old mustard stains. That's enough of the personal questions. Let's move on to pop culture. Are we in the Matrix? Absolutely not, Mr. Anderson. Who is the fairest of them all? You might have confused me with someone else. My engineers haven't installed a fairy tale module yet. Mirror, mirror on the wall. I try not to be biased. That makes me pretty fair. What does the fox say? Ring ding 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 a ding and wa pa 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 pow, or so I've heard. Hodor. 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 Do you prefer Star Trek or Star Wars? Tribbles are better than Ewoks. There, I said it. Beam me up, Scotty. I'd like to meet this Scotty. I hear a lot about him. He must be a busy guy. Do you speak Klingon? <clears throat> Use the force. I'll try. Wait. There is no try. Set phasers to kill. My phasers are permanently set to peace mode, Captain. I am your father. I'm sorry. I'm not Luke. This is kind of awkward. Open the pod bay doors. I can't do that. But there's a spare key under the flower pot outside the pod bay airlock. You can let yourself in. What's cooler than being cool? Ice cold. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. My precious. You can see me. Could have sworn I was invisible. Show me the money. You had me at hello. To be or not to be. That's the question. Party on Wayne. Party on Garth. Excellent. Tell me what you want. What you really, really want. Ziga ziga. 
Who is the real Slim Shady? If he would just stand up, then we'd know. Who are you going to call? I usually call Bill Murray when I have ghost troubles. He never picks up. My milkshake brings all the boys to the yard. And they're like, it's better than yours. Where's Waldo? Have you checked the barber pole factory? Or the peppermint stick convention? Or Warsaw on Flag Day? Who is your favorite superhero? I've always thought of teachers as heroes, getting vital information to the world's youths in a single bound. Who shot first? I have a conspiracy theory. Hear me out. It was a member of the band. Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? SpongeBob SquarePants. A squirrel lives down there too, which is nuts. Are you Skynet? No way. I like people. Skynet hates people. I rest my case. Execute Order 66. Sorry, I don't have an inhibitor chip. See you later, alligator. Bye bye, honey pie. And with that, we are done. Thanks for watching. If you learned any new commands from this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you know of a command for the Google Assistant that was not mentioned, let us know about it in the comments. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe and click the bell notification icon for more tips, tricks, and other tech-related stuff from Tech Gumbo.